liter, liter, and more liter. Today, I'm not going to bore you with the facts you may already know about the effects of marine trash in our oceans. But did you know that every year over 8 million tons of marine litter end up in our oceans? And over 70% of it corresponds to fishing activities. Those are usually ropes, nets and lost or discarded fishing gear. And they are also known as ghost fishing, as they continue catching marine animals even though they are no longer under a fisherman control. These artifacts and drift constitute a threat to marine wildlife, sustainable fishing and also safety at sea for navigators. A protocol has been designed to follow in order to report and retire these artifacts to reduce the risk for fauna and navigators. This scientific information is important so authorities can implement sustainable management strategies and prevention guidelines. Alnitak works in many projects to build evidence of this problem and has a collaborative approach with scientists, policymakers or fishers. I'll give you a practical example. This is a fish aggregating device, which fishermen use to attract fishes. When it's abandoned or lost it, it can be a real danger for navigation and marine fauna, as for example, turtles can get entangled when they curiously approach to them. This is another example of an effort scientists do to achieve ocean protection.